Oven, so that we may have bread. Touch my oven, and I shall push you into it. Perry Cottle? You'll not get away with it. Alewife, poisoner, witch. What the hell is he talking about? What is going on here? Mr. Cotto, while trying to guess at Lucy's secret ingredient, you poisoned yourself. Phytolaca. Highly toxic. What? No! That, that is not possible! Not just possible. Not even just likely. I'd say it was inevitable. I... What I thought... Well, that proves it. She did it on purpose. She picked pokeweed on purpose! What do you say to that, Mistress Barrow? I'm a woman. No husband. A business of my own. Means. Brains. And I dared to say no to a man. This man. I have all sorts of poisonous plants. I'm a herbalist and an alewife. I make things. If Perry Cottle, in his ignorance, tried to do the same, then that is on him. Perry Cottle, in your harassment of the alewife, you were relentless. I don't, I don't believe a word she says, and neither should you. She knew I'd uncover a secret, so she killed me with magic. Are you really going to let me stand here, suffering this idiot's harassment from beyond the grave? For the last time, I am the bloody alewife! You heard her? She admits it! She dares to say it out loud! She is the bloody alewife. She's a witch. She's a witch. And she must be stopped. Lucy Barrow, under the pretext of a demand for fair payment, you hoarded a valuable recipe. That's right. You'd have starved us for the sake of your business. You denied the children of God their daily bread. For business, Lucy. For business. Our Lord called you to give service to his flock, and you demanded payment. Let the alewife speak, Mr. Cottle. If the Lord wished the fruits of my labour, then he should have paid me like anyone else. I worked hard for where I am today. I deserve to succeed. I worked my ass off for it, and you would have me give it away. Not a chance. Let's put an end to this, shall we? Perry Cottle, the alewife Lucy Barrow is not responsible for your death. You are wrong to haunt her. The witch poisoned me! She called you a dolt. I'm inclined to agree. Just won't learn, Cotto, will you? You are dead. You are no more. I'll get on with it, if you don't mind. Good day to you.